Hey guys, today we're gonna kill a monkey. So let's get into it. So get a monkey, a little Suzanne over here, and subdivide it if you want with control 2. And add a plane. Uh, bring the monkey up or the plane down, and let's bring the plane down. And scale out the plane 5. Now go into edit preferences and enable the cell fracture add-on. I already have it enabled as you can see. So now go to object, quick effects, oh wait, apply the subdivision and then do object, quick effects, cell fracture. And do add some noise. Now Oh, we got a weird one here. That's fine, we can delete that, maybe. Can we? No. So, the problem there might be that the eyes are like that. They're... I'll just delete all these cells so you can see. In the Suzanne mesh, the eyes are a separate... They're a separate object. Kind of besides the monkey head so do L on both of the eyes and delete them and grab the edge loops on the outside of the eyes and press F it's kinda creepy but you can inset them in and bring them out a bit like that and then just do the cell fracture again and let's see if it worked it did so now grab one of these cells and make it a rigid body and do F3 and copy rigid body settings and make this a passive rigid body And then also make all these objects set origin to center of mass volume. And they shouldn't wobble as much when they fall. So now we've killed Suzanne and broken her apart. And some pieces might fall through and just delete those. And do that until no pieces fall through. Heck. There we go, no pieces are falling anymore. And now, we've just got a Suzanne that breaks when it falls on the ground. So if you liked that, subscribe and check out the Intermediate Tutorials playlist for more tutorials like this. See you guys next time!